The 2-2 pitch. Chopped down the first baseline. Gloved by Samuelson. Flips to I. Foot race to the bag, and I wins it. That's some good PFP right there. Big time play by a first baseman. Of course, I have an affinity to it. We're heading to the bottom of the second. No score here in San Luis. One out on the board. Two men in scoring position for the number nine hitter, Dylan Doherty. First pitch, swing and a ground ball up the middle. Sliding stop by Valenzuela. Throws from his backside, unable to get Doherty, who brings home the first run of the night. What an effort by Saheed Valenzuela. Watch this, folks. I mean, this youngster, not a big kid, but he is a baseball player. Watch him throw from his knees right here, and it's just a little bit wide for Curtis at first. And, of course, Doherty smells a hit. Well, and he... Ninth pitch of the at-bat to Gernick. Runner goes again. This time a fair ball in the shallow right. Richards will make the catch. Tagging from third is DiCarlo. He's going to try. Throw to the plate. He is not in time. Doherty advances to second. 2 nothing. Cal Poly. Well, that's just some good baseball by Cal Poly right here. Watch this now. You're going to see the catch by Richards. Here comes the throw, but you got to love the base running by Doherty at first base. The minute he sees that ball going to the dish, he takes off to second, and just like that, although... Titans last inning, stranded a runner at third, trying to break through here. 2-1, Bunn is off, ground ball to second, could be two. Gernick, long toss to second for one on at first. You can make that two. Well done by Doherty again at shortstop. Well, it's this is a there's a lot of good stuff going on right here. Uh, you see Samuelson's in on the grass. Watch him the first baseman. That ball, ball's hit, he drops back to first. You see Gernick over to Doherty, and so he can run a little bit, and they turn this 4-6-3 double play and out. Get a ground ball right to Borgonio at third, and he was able to gun down Green at the plate. Ground ball left side, snared by Valenzuela. He looks the runner back and then airmails the throw into the dugout. Free base for everybody, and Cal Poly's got two in scoring position. They'll make that a run scored. They're going to move Beasley all the way in. Now you see it right there. It ends up in the dugout, and that's one plus one. Exciting games. Look, this is a, a beautiful part of the Golden State. Ground ball over to third. Borgonio looks the runner back, and he air nails the throw. Two errors on the inning, and Cal Poly's got another run out of it. Now the throw to second, not in time. Well, there's not a lot you could say about this. It's just, you mentioned it. Borgonio checks the runner and just airmails it. And how does this happen a lot of times? You will stand up, and there you see Sands heading to second, and the throw to Saheed at shortstop was actually high from Curtis. So that's three straight. But a lot of times when you have this play, this ground ball to third base with a runner, you want to check him. And when you catch the ball, you're in an athletic position. But once you check that runner, you'll see defenders, they will stand up. And consequently, when you stand up and then throw, your arm will drop. Consequently, the ball will sail, and that's what you saw right there. That, that's that's not normal. I mean, we've talked about it. It's in the last nine years. Sharply hit to short. Well fielded by Doherty to second for one. Not in time to turn two. But Dylan Doherty's playing a very good shortstop tonight. Well, listen, he's had some errors this year, and, and this club leads the Big West in errors. But watch Doherty lay some leather on here, and he gets it over to Gernick, and they almost turn this 6-4-3 double play. What a pretty good day defensively as well. well AJ Curtis, the bat. Excuse me, Sam, but you never know. Runner goes. Throw over to second is in time. Emerson gets his man. 
Gold gloves all of a sudden tonight, right? Good stuff. Cal Poly falling 16 to 2 yesterday. They are all hyped up right now. Well, how about this real quick feed from Emerson? He shuts down this inning. We're heading to the bottom of the fourth. It's all Cal Poly. Ben Orla taking the helm for an iconic Mike Gillespie. Swing and a drive out to left field. Garcia going back on it at the warning track, and it's off the wall. Rounding third and heading home is Elijah Green. It's an RBI double, and it's 5-0 Cal Poly. Well, where is this location? The ball is up, and he does not miss it. Hits it right off the base of the wall, and with two outs, Green is going on this, and there's no chance they're going to get Green at the dish. And just like that, 5 nothing, as you mentioned, Cal Poly. But again, it, it'd be the six in the East. It's going to be a fun run. Looking forward to a lot of great games here in the next few weeks. Great effort so far tonight by Bobby I. Continues a punch out of Daniel Cope to start the seventh. Deep breath and the one, two. That's a strike. <laughs> Bobby I is fired up. Well, he's fired up for a couple reasons, and hopefully the umpire knows why, but he has been sensational tonight, and Bobby I strike three, and he is cruising tonight at Cal Poly. As a, as a manager, and now here comes Larry right now, and he's going to go to the pen. And... Most likely that last walk right there was obviously he didn't like what he saw and that those five, six pitches right there. Well, almost 2,500 in attendance, and they're going to give Bobby I a well-earned round of applause. Well, it was a tremendous job by I. Seven and a third shutout innings for Bobby I. And he'll turn things over to the pen with a 5 nothing lead. O2 pitch. Swing and a nice strike three. That's your ball game. Cal Poly falls 16 to 2 last night and come right back. And beat Cal State Fullerton by a final score of five to three. Well, it's the best game in the world, Sam. We talked about it. You mentioned last night the Titans came in here and basically buried Cal Poly Mustangs. And you see the strike three right there. And this series, Sam, even one and one, winner takes the series tomorrow. 